So tell you everything that happened, right? Exactly. You're not allowed to say that. <laughs> <laughs> DNR, so oh, shoot. You didn't read the DNR. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Do not resuscitate. This That's guy. what's going to happen. <laughs> That's exactly mm-hmm. yeah. I won't bring you back. I, I, this is my last one. <laughs> Questions, so, comments, yeah, yeah. Great to see. And I love how your character is being approached. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so I was just wondering how would you describe your character? Animal, lion, I would to say he's the owl. <laughs> he's always, uh, yeah, he makes that noise a lot. Uh, <laughs> but like he's always kind of searching and trying to figure out what's going on and trying to be a voice of wisdom or reason. Uh, so I feel like he's sitting on his perch just watching and. Trying to take it all in and hopefully find a cockroach to squish. Yeah, someone's humble. <laughs> <laughs> how was the? A, oh, go ahead. I was. How was the fan reaction to the screening of the premiere earlier? I think it was positive. Uh-huh. I think it was great. It was fun. It was fun oh, yeah. to watch it in a big screen with all those people. So like yeah. watching a uh, premiere of a movie, you know, mm-hmm. people laughing at the screen, people like applauding. Someone was talking about him. Who? Uh, <laughs> if, I, uh, if I saw that, I gave him a couple. Of Decide. You got to give him a look. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, the glasses. Mm-hmm. That's 100%. It. The glasses is huge. And if they didn't stop there, they'll stop. Right, this person is not a member of society. Yeah. 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 He's a <laughs> Play lawyer. You mind? Yeah. I'm trying to watch myself emote. I've had a movie with Richard where he's walked up to somebody and be like, excuse me, I'm oh, yeah. trying to watch a film. Yeah. I once, saw, this was, I once thought I left my, my laptop right in front of my fireplace and the fire on. Yeah. And I was like, it's going to overheat my laptop, it's going to explode, and my whole apartment's going to be on fire when I get back. And I was at the movie and like, do you want to go back? And I was like, no, nah, we're here, it's the Martian, let's watch it. And it started, and the guy answered his phone. Like, answered it. He was like, and I leaned forward, I was like, I was like, take it outside. And he was like, it's, it's my wife. And I went, I don't care it's your wife. My apartment is on fire. <laughs> Put your phone away. <laughs> you know, the, people with phones and movies yeah, is my like Oh, I get so mad. You're ruining the sanctity of it's a like beautiful taking experience. a phone in yeah. church. Yeah. Like, what are you doing? Yeah. Was the computer okay? It was fine. The apartment was fine too. <laughs> Will there be a lot more uh, um, Murphy and Clark scenes uh, with Murphy not forgiving her still. I think uh, Murphy's trust is something once broken it's not easy to get back. I mean, not, he breaks people's trust all the time. So it's a little hypocritical of him. But yeah, I think that's going to be a relationship that, that they're going to need to work on. And it's not just her, it's, it's, it's Murphy as well. Um, Without giving too much away, <laughs> there are some really, really interesting new dynamics between not a way that you would It's a lot. Yeah. Is that this- ominous? Really, really <laughs> Yeah. That's, that's all you should be doing. Foreboding. Pretty great. Made. He forebodes the foreboded. I'm out here foreboding. Even foreboded. Forbaden. How do you feel? <laughs> I feel good. For <laughs> and Murphy and um, Murphy and Jordan have an, uh, a good relationship, I believe. This is you're kind of Uncle Murphy. Yeah. That's right. I think so he, how do yeah. you take that on? I that think one? it's it's an interesting relationship between him and Jordan because he it's hard for Murphy to look at him because he reminds him so much of his dad and his mom, um, specifically his dad. And I think that's a relationship that Murphy miss will miss. Is him and Monty, uh, even though he never would have said it to Monty's face. I think he had a lot of love for him, a lot of respect for him. So I think he's gonna, he is kind of like, he's protective of Jordan in a different way than, like, let's say, like Clark. <laughs> it's different for him. He wants to see him do good, he wants to see him have fun, he wants to see him be his own man. But at the same time, I think it's hard for him to look at him. It's hard. Will there be a kind of because he's kind of the new, fresh kid of like everything's new to him? Yeah, it's very. Is there like some kind of hazing because he doesn't know that it's a joke? Like Richard or, 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 or like the spoiler police? You really <laughs> repeat the question. <laughs> Will there be any kind of fit, hazing of Jordan at all because it is everything is so new to him? It's probably yeah. quite easy to it's, I think uh, it's, joke around with him. It's awesome to see. Yeah. 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 yeah, I think it's awesome to see. It'll be so great to have Jordan there because seeing a brand new world through our eyes would be interesting. Seeing it through his eyes is, is something really different. I think he sees things okay. so differently than the rest of us. Uncle Murphy, mother. Yeah. Murphy. Uncle Murphy. <laughs>